All right. Uh, well, Mr. Pradhan, coming to you next. How are markets expected to react if the NDA finishes with less than 400 seats? Well, actually, the question now is reversed, right? There was a time when uh, we were asking whether they will reach 400. Mm. And now we are saying that if they don't reach 400, what next? I think uh, we are getting a little bit carried away here by the number per se. I think what we should uh, really focus on is the fact that uh, what does a majority help the government do? So conventional wisdom tells us that uh, if we are talking about uh, continuing reform, you will require a majority in parliament to be able to pass certain key reform initiatives. And if you have more seats in your favor, uh, the likelihood of these reforms passing without significant challenge is, is very high. So I think one of the things which we are talking about right now is that the government, if it is coming with a very strong mandate, it provides an opportunity for everyone to understand that maybe uh, there is a chance that the government can push through some very significant reform without much opposition uh, through the parliamentary process. And I think that is the reason why this number of seats becomes very important. However, I must say that this 400 uh, is a coalition number. Uh, there will always be differences over time. So as in markets, you need to be prepared for every uncertainty. I think it's a strong indication that such kind of economic uh, reform can actually pass through now much faster if you've got 400. But I would not worry that if they come anywhere lesser than 400, that there is a there is a reverse impact on the market to an extent that people uh, will throw in the towel and the market will crash from here. So, so I, I wouldn't think the reverse will happen. There will be mild reactions and there will be fluctuations all along the way. Right. Just uh, following up on that, you spoke about 400, uh, close to 400 is just a temporary blip, if at all. What reforms are you specifically talking about from markets perspective that you see the government uh, throwing forward from here? So there is a fairly significant agenda yet left for us to complete. Uh, one of the things which we recently saw from a markets perspective was an inclusion of the Indian bond markets in the international indexes. Uh, now, the follow through from there is also something which is expected. And there will be some reform required to ensure that the global markets get very seamlessly integrated with our markets. There are certain sovereign issues which ensure that uh, we may not be able to open up our markets to the extent uh, which the, the global markets and the indices require us to be. Uh, but I think it's a welcome change that we have begun our process there. So that's one from a bond markets perspective. From an equity markets perspective, I don't think there is any significant change or reform that we are expecting from the indexes and the operation of the activity of the markets themselves. But I think there is always something there which will ensure that we will have people who expect certain sectors to do significantly better on the back of any change in the laws that we currently have. So I think it is a matter of uh, debate in terms of what are the difficult reforms yet to be done. Uh, I think one of the significant areas of reform that we are all looking for from an industry perspective is, is labor reform. I think this is something which has uh, come in and gone as an agenda for a long time. No significant progress seems to be on the anvil for this. Uh, but I think that might be one area that uh, the industry, especially manufacturing, may be looking forward to, to ensure that India becomes a significantly fair place to hire, fire, and set up industry at a very short space. We are talking about land acquisition. We are talking about so many other issues which uh, currently still need some significant reform to be able to have this business environment improve mm. dramatically than what we were here. So, so just a few examples of what we can expect. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.